Hello everybody, Zai here and in today's video for the first time I record an introduction. Please let me know how you like this new tin. In today's video I'm going to show you how I made four different Boa Hancock cosplays from One Piece, which were a commission, all four for the same person. And so I'll try to show you how I made this, which materials I used, and um, that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. For the base patterns, I used a tipao I bought some years ago. I copied the outline into the white fabrics. It's the same I'm gonna use for the yellow and pink dresses. I copied the school and circle patterns right away from the original design and then copied it several times into thermoadhesive vinyl. This material is really easy to use. You just have to iron over the material and it will stick into the fabrics. Then peel off the plastic, repeat for all of the schools and follow the same process with the circles. I divided them into four pieces. This way I saved up a lot of material. This vinyl is also stretchy so it won't break when you pull into the fabrics. Afterwards sew a golden stripe around the bottom edge of the dress. You can follow the exact same process for the yellow and pink dresses. As you can see, it's very stretchy. I had glued a string of feathers into the bottom edge of the purple dress. Since the yellow dress is not stretchy, I had to cut an opening around the neck area and then hand sew a couple of buttons. This thing is called a panko and honestly I don't know how to explain how I made it. So just follow my steps. And then sew it into the upper flap. And sew a loop into the bottom one as well. Intermission because we're moving into the harder dress now. Cut out this shape out of vinyl a million times. And then a few more of this cloudy shape. Start ironing them into a rectangle of fabrics which will be the skirt. You can find the patterns of this dress in my other Boa Hancock video, which I'll leave in the description. Cut out the circle out of two layers of BBA foam and cover it with golden fabrics. And voila! I didn't record anything else about this dress. This is the first time I'm recording an introduction for a video. From now on, I'll try to do voiceovers. And anyways, I hope you liked the video. Let me know if you have any doubts and I'll try to answer anything as good as I can. 